My family ended up coming to Episcopal right after Hurricane Katrina. We were in the process of selling out the house we were living in, buying a bigger house, but in the New Orleans area. And Hurricane Katrina hit, and we had to evacuate. And it was at that time my husband decided he did not want to live in the New Orleans area anymore. He wanted to live in the Baton Rouge area. I told him, I said, okay, that's fine, but I will not consider moving unless Chris gets into Episcopal. So we went looking for houses. We found a house in Gonzales. The next step was to come over to Episcopal, try to set up the meetings, set up the interviews, and, and we spoke to the admission director, and we told her, our buying this house is contingent on Chris getting into Episcopal. And Chris did his, his play date, he did his testing, and by the next week she called us and said, sign the papers, and we did. And it was probably one of the best decisions we could have made. Now, keep in mind, we bought a house in Gonzales. It was at least an hour drive to get here in the morning during rush out of our traffic. It was totally worth it. I would do it again. Episcopal is more than a school in that it is a family, it is a community of people that really, really, really care about you. Chris' dad passed away when he was in fifth grade. Very unexpected, devastating to us as a family. I was totally devastated. The teachers provided what he needed at that time that I was in no shape to give him. He would go talk to Ms. Manser. He would talk to Ms. Arsenal. They knew that we were going through a really difficult time. And guess what? They stepped up. My friends stepped up. Episcopal stepped up. The faculty stepped up. They were really there for us. I lost my mom in March. And I had no idea that they were going to come. I was at the church, and I see coming across the street my Episcopal friends and family. They were there for me then. They were there when my husband passed away. It's during these times, when times of trouble, times of sorrow that you know who your friends are and who care about you. And my Episcopal family showed us how much they cared about us. So this is Episcopal. This is what they do. This is what they do when you become a part of their family. And I am still, I am friends with these people to this day. I will always look at Episcopal as my extended family.